This is an ABC Action News tracking the traffic's update. Brought to you by The Wise Company. You can't prevent certain events in life, but you can prepare for them. Hello everyone, I'm ABC Action News Meteorologist Greg D. An active tropical Atlantic out there watching for potential development later in the week in the north central Atlantic. No worries to anyone from there. Our three hurricanes or storms in the Atlantic now and a area of uh, showers and thunderstorms in the Caribbean and southern Gulf that is expected now to become something as it heads towards Mexico or south Texas later in the week. Helena is not a storm we'll need to be concerned about. Florence is the one that has really uh, got everybody uh, really watching it carefully. I wall a replacement cycle going on early on this Tuesday morning. A new eye is forming. Outflow is looking very impressive. This storm should continue to strengthen after going through maybe some uh, weak strengthening or weak uh, weakening uh, during the overnight. Latest track from the Hurricane Center brings it toward the Carolina coast and slows it down, even stops it with some of the new model information this morning, and that could mean potentially devastating flooding first along the coast and then spreading inland into next week. Charlotte, Columbia, uh, Richmond, Virginia all need to watch this. Look what the models are doing this morning. Little loops here and some of them then even send it farther south into South Carolina. So Charleston to Norfolk still watching this thing very carefully. This could be a very difficult forecast for the North Carolina coast as they could go through several hours of hurricane or several days of hurricane conditions. The Euro just basically stops the storm here near Wrightsville Beach, Jacksonville, North Carolina, down to Myrtle Beach. The Hurricane Center forecast pushes it inland, but if some of these new models are will be consistent in the next couple of days, we may have to adjust the Hurricane Center forecast quite a bit after landfall, slowing it down and pushing the system farther south. Definitely something to watch. Isaac now will continue into the Caribbean. It is a tropical storm, may become a brief hurricane before weakening again. Still a lot of uncertainty of how much of the storm survives through the Caribbean. We'll continue to watch it right now. No immediate threat to Florida and Helene. Write that one off. It's going to head up towards the Azores. Could see tropical storm watches posted for the Azores. Those are parts of Portugal, Europe in the next couple of days. Unusual track there.